Welcome to Scholarships Ads. Today we are going to discuss about about Henry's Bowl Foundation Scholarships. So, in order to access Henry's Bowl Foundation Scholarships and to apply for it, we will visit the scholarshipsads.com link that is given in the description box below. And uh, here, you know, on scholarshipsads.com we post scholarships on daily basis. Uh, either they can be fully funded, partially funded, like all type of scholarship in the world you can find on scholarshipsads.com. So it's a very versatile website and we have uh, designed uh, it in such a way that it is very easy to access things on it. So let's talk about Henry's Ball Foundation Scholarship. Yes, and don't forget to subscribe our channel and our website as well for daily updates. So let's see our Henry's Ball Foundation Scholarship 2024. Yes, it is a full scholarship, fully funded scholarship, and it's gonna expire in 155 days. So yeah, there's a bit more time. Let's uh, talk about the description. Here is the description. Let's see. Study in Germany with Heinrich Boll Foundation this scholarship program, which is currently open for applications. Yes, it is currently open. You can apply for this scholarship. This scholarship is fully funded scholarship. Uh, here, opportunity. It is for masters and PhD students, and it. The main targets are the international students. Like it is a very, very golden opportunity for the international students to uh, go and study in Germany. So let's talk about the organization. This uh, scholarship is being offered by the Heinrich Bull Foundation, and in German language, it is uh, known as the Heinrich Bull Stiftung. It is, uh, a, it is an actually a very prominent German political foundation that operates internationally and uh, it is, uh, you know, Heinrich Wohl, it is a very, uh, very respectable foundation, you can say. It has done many work. So, they are focusing on various to uh, areas like uh, democracy, civil society, environmental sustainability. As you know, the main issue of like in today's world is global warming. So here they are focusing mainly on the environmentalism. It actually supports initiatives and projects related to climate protection, renewable energy and ecological sustainability. So here is a very brief description about the organization. You can access the link uh, from the description box below and don't forget to subscribe our channel for more updates. Degree level. It is open to this fully funded scholarship is open to masters and PhD levels at uh, programs at German universities and it is available for all subjects so don't worry about like is it available or not you can easily access to any kind of subject at any university in germany germany and let's talk about the scholarship benefit as you know it is a full scholarship it is going to cover your airfare your tuition fee your accommodation and your stipend like everything it is going to get covered in this scholarship and um, as I told, as I already told you, this scholarship is open to international students of all nationalities. What is the eligibility criteria to be selected for this scholarship? In order to be eligible, there are two main things: proficiency in English. It would be very beneficial for you if you have a TOEFL or IELTS exam uh, and you have scored a very good uh, marks in it. You have a very good band in it, actually. Uh, so what is the, actually the key idea for the student scholarship? There are two types of scholarships for the masters and doctorals ones. So let's talk about the student scholarship first. Exceptional academic performance in a school or college or university. In order to get this scholarship, this fully funded scholarship, you need to show 
exceptional academic performance like in school you should be having a very good grade in college or university you should be having a very good grade or GPA demonstrated social engagement and a keen interest in political matters so it is a very plus point for you if you have a very keen interest in political matters as I told you that it is a very it is a political organization so yeah it is also a key criteria for it why do you want this scholarship what are the reasons that you are seeking for the Handbridge Bowl Foundation scholarship this is the key criteria in your academic writing uh, academic uh, CV you should be mentioning why do you want to seek this scholarship I have also linked uh, linked uh, in the description column that how can you build up your academic CV you can access the link from the description box below what is the key criteria for the doctoral scholarship and like it is same the first one is same as above like you have, you should be having an, a good academic record in both school and university and the second one is presentation of a compelling research project like you should be having a very good academic research project in your portfolio so that including an exposed innovative research approach realistic timetable and preliminary work at an advanced stage like this should be the key things that should be present in your research project active involvement in social and political causes as you know i have already told you that this is uh, you know this is a political organization so they take a very keen interest in people who are engaged in social and political causes so strong well reasoned motivation for applying to the Henrich Paul foundation you should be having your strong reasons persuasive reasons to apply for this Henrich Paul foundation scholarship application procedure what is the application procedure and how you can apply for it to apply for the Henrich Paul foundation scholarship please adhere to the following application guidelines okay Determine whether you qualify for the special focus groups in this particular application round. So you should see the key criteria that either you are eligible or not. You should familiarize yourself with the application process and the required documentation. So when you are going to access this uh, link from the description box below, you are going to find a link down below here here i have linked the official website of this page here you can find the application form and the desired information you want the additional information that you want from the organization and the scholarships so what are the required documents that are needed to be submitted for the scholarship a personal information and cv as i've told you the academic cv is very important and a very crucial element in the scholarships uh, so in order to make a very good academic cv you can check out our blog on it in the description box below a statement explaining your motiva motivation for applying yes you should be having a very strong reason for applying for this Henry's World Foundation scholarship like why should you get this scholarship an outline detailing your motivation for studying or your chosen subject your primary areas of interest they should be also mentioned in it uh, as your CV will contain all these stuff an outline of your social engagement, political interests, and all your proposed PhD thesis process. If you are a master's student, you should be having a uh, proposed PhD thesis project. As well as you should be socialized person, you should be having social engagement, and you should be having a political interested uh, interest. So you can talk all about it in your CV and in, and in your personal information. So for more requirement, uh, you can for further information actually you can access the link here I have linked the doctoral scholarship scholarship and here the student scholarship so if you click here you can find the additional requirements so let's go to the website 
this is the main page of the scholarship application here they have written what is uh, the about a bit about the scholarship the scholarship department of the Heinrich Bull Foundation grants scholarship to graduates and doctoral students from outside Germany means you know international students so but it is not open to undergraduate degree uh, under undergraduates okay so this should be kept in mind while applying for this scholarship the deadline is 1st march and 1st september as you know that the 1st september of 2023 has been passed so we will uh, talk about 1st march so here we will consider that the next deadline is 1st march okay so you can uh, access the application portal uh, six weeks before the application deadline so i guess it will be around in january so keep a check on this thing international applicants have to prove their proficiency is in german good or very good knowledgeable of the german language is required at least p2 level or dsh2 there are many apps that uh, help you prepare for the german language as you know that eyes are no, uh, they, the Germans uh, actually prefer German language more than you know uh, they prefer English they prefer German over English mm -hmm. so it is a very key uh, it is a very plus point for you if you have a proficiency in German language or if you don't have it's perfectly okay at least you should know a bit of it you can go through a Duolingo app they offer many good uh, you know training on it and there are many other websites i will link it in the description below so you can access and you know start learning german and for more information you can you can visit their german website and the application application process is same as i have told you before and um, these are the information sheets student scholarships doctoral scholarship pfds and etc okay so that's all for today i hope this information was useful for you i hope that you are going to apply for this scholarship it's a fully funded scholarship and a good opportunity for students who are willing to study in germany so let me know if you like the video like uh, please don't forget to subscribe our channel and please share with others so it can you know you never know who is gonna get help from this video thank you so much